Hello everyone, my name's Ilya2 and welcome back to my Let's Play uh, of Victoria 2 with the Napoleon's Legacy mod with the Mughal Empire. Yes, so in the last episode, as you can see, we have finally united all 100% of India. Yay! That's, that's just fantastic. Um, it was hard. Well, I mean, Japan honestly helped us out most of the way. They're a great ally. <sighs> Looking at you, North German Federation. Only 31 brigades. You're fucking pathetic and I hate you. Anyway, so uh, our industry has exploded. We're third best in the world. Who's number one? Is it? Yep, France. We can easily beat France. And who's number one in uh, prestige? France. Well, once we start dismantling nations, I'm sure we'll beat France as well. So, uh, yay. Yay, yay, yay. So, just looking at the world. Union Guiana. Right, forgot about that. Poor British Empire. Poor, uh, Victoria. This game's named after her, and yet, she fell apart. Anyway, so, let's split in half here. Why do we have one too many artillery? I think it's because we need to send one over there. Oh, boy, here we go. That's five whole bri uh, five whole brigades. Five whole armies, fully built up. Nice. And we're still making a bit of money. <laughs> so, who has more soldiers than we do? Uh, well, the Qing. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, we have like the largest army on Earth right now. It's pretty damn good, boy. And of course, we can recruit another 3 million. 3 million men will get uh, risen up for uh, mobilization. That is uh, a, bit, a bit much, I'd say. Go ahead and get army risk management. Actually, uh, anti-rationalism. We do need that. So we can research a lot faster. Look at our literacy. Only increasing by 0 0.05 a, a month. Yeah, a month. Oh, God, that is that is slow. Maybe I'll get up to 50% by the end of the series. Yay! That's not very long, too. It's coming close. Uh, let's build up all these projects. Of course, you can expand whatever you want. You can expand whatever you want. Gas attack! Hello, beautiful. Yes, we will attend. By the way, uh, how's the naval bases? We need to expand these. Expand all of them to level 4 and beyond. Uh, what, right there? Level 4. Uh, that'll let us build um, battleships and cruisers and all that other fun stuff. Look at that. Already got some level 4 in areas. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Um, anywhere else? Yep, over here. Over here. Yes, yes, very nice. Over here. Over here. And over here. And here. And in, uh, totally forgot about Vietnam. We're darn Vietnam. Whatever. Except the losses. I don't need all the tea in the world. Who really cares? Which you mean immediately. America, you gotta conquer the uh, Native Confederation. It annoys the shit out of me that they still exist with five states. Jesus Christ. Let's see here again. How many? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, five fucking states. Jesus Christ, America. And, uh, yeah, there are like no blacks left in America. All just Yankees. No Dixies as well. Hmm. Mummy found orphans rejoice. Get it? Get it, mummy? Do you... Do you get it? It's a mummy. Do you get it? Got guys do you, got guys do you get it? It's mummy. Guys, do you no, I'm just kidding. Um all right. So Cuba, Cuba is being Cuba. Who can we dismantle today? Did we just lose someone? Was there a rebellion? What the fuck? French communists. Um hello. This is not France. Well, now that we have gas attack, this will be very easy. So, uh, just go ahead and hunt rebels. Because that's really, I believe, the only people we're going to be fighting for, like, ever. So, uh, go have fun. I just totally remembered these aren't our rebels, so they don't want to fight them. Which is kind of weird. Dismantle against the British Union. Hmm. Mm hmm. Well, we really can't fight the British Union. Their capital ships are just too powerful. I think they have some battleships, so, uh... Fine, we'll gain it, but we won't use it. I would love to dismantle the British Union. But 
just ain't gonna happen, you know? Just ain't gonna happen. Alright, so we just killed 27,000 Frenchmen. I am okay with that. I hate how the game does this. Like, why, why is there French communists in my land? That makes no fucking sense. Game, come on. Step your game up, huh? Get it, get it. Step your game up, and it's a game, and it's, it's funny. It's funny. Ha ha. Funny. Shut up. Anyways, uh, so we need to reorganize this army. Get him over there, and over there, and over there, and everywhere. All right, go there. Just defend the area. Overall, defend it. Yes, yes, yes. Gain some consciousness like I give a shit. Are there even any Frenchmen over here? Oh, looks like a very minimal... Yeah, very minimal amount of Frenchies. It's good for us. Do we accept... Okay, so Punjabi. It looks as though Punjabi are spreading. Is these... No, these are Rajput. These are all the Punjabi. These are our main culture. Just this one. And it consists of... Um, less than 10% of our population, and we're, that's the only one we're representing, because we're residency. Just to put that into, into a perspective. That's pretty fucked up. Alright, fine, we'll expand them on our own. Oh my god, there's 100,000 unemployed craftsmen in the United Provinces. Holy shit, United Provinces, you need to calm your tits. Look at that, 450, about half. Half of all our industry is in the United Provinces. That is ridiculous. And what's our total population in the United... Yeah, 15, only 15%. We have only 5.55 craftsmen. And we're already about to become the most industrialized nation in the world. We're going to surpass Germany, North Germany, but it's really Germany at this point. <sighs> so I saw Egypt and Sudan. Yeah, fuck Egypt. Not, neither of those are my problem. And there you go. Sudan has gained its land. Good for it. So now Egypt is now modern day Egypt minus the Suez Canal. Madagascar and Poland, Lithuania. Fuck you guys. May fuck you guys. May. May a fuck you. A fuck you. A fuck you. Come on, build all these factories, guys. We need more factories. I'll expand anything you want. You don't need to pay for it. Just calm down. But if you want to build railroads, I am okay with that, because I like me some roads on rails. Fine, go wool. Wool isn't a cash crop. It's not a crop. I guess it is. I mean, you grow it on sheep. So, And it's a farm, so would you still consider it to be a crop? I don't know. I really don't know. Anti-rationalism. Yay! Alright, keep expanding everything. Let's go, biologism. Or do we want something else? Like steel steamers, pre-dreadnoughts. Pre I need me the battle, I need me some battleships, yo. We got lots of open naval power. And we desperately need battleships. If we are to ever dismantle any of these nations. Oh my god, Dutch communists. Are they gonna free their nations? They only have 21, ooh. Dutch communists, colonial chaos. We're going to see Indonesia pop out, and if Indonesia pops out as an... I believe they're civilized, but if they pop out as uncivilized, I can go annex them. Oh, what's this? Oh, Japan. Japan took over uh, Selangor. Fuck you, Japan. That just fucks with the border, so... That's one province, so we'll consider that just a city. Just a city. Oh, that's Singapore. Okay, so that's where Singapore is. I mean, I knew it was in this area, but that's just directly... Never mind. Oh my god, how much how many Dutchmen are in Singapore? What the hell? Is that is that real? Like that much Dutch people? That much Dutch? That many Dutch? Double Dutch? Look at that. Oh my god. How are we not beyond Germany now? Come on, game. Did we just build a bunch of people in the United Provinces? Probably. And uh yep, keep expanding everything, keep building everything up. Go, go, go. We need a fuck ton of stuff. Oddly enough, we're gaining the most, um, fish. Or we're taking in a bunch of fish. I guess we don't need lots of a lumber, cement, and steel. We're, we're, like, building it ourselves. And a war to end all wars, so now great wars are even better. Oh boy, and now we're gaining fascists. Yay. 
So Steel Steamers built. Um, we're going to want Dreadnoughts eventually, but let's get Army Risk Management, some more military tactics and uh, morale right back to our industry. We can now build battleships. Yay! So everyone who can build a battleship, build a fucking battleship. And do it quickly, please. I do indeed want me some battleships. All right, so how's everything going? Uh, it's going good. Let's bring this up to 60% tariffs because we're losing a bit of money. We're losing out on a bit of money over here. How many capitalists do we have? 744,000, and yet only 11,000 are actually investing. Fuck you guys. You guys don't know your job. San Francisco earthquake. I'd like to point out, in this entire series... Our only rebellion has been a small Yakiman rebellion and the main rebellions in the very beginning. I don't know what's happened to the rebellions, but I guess we've just kept um, Milton Sea low enough. That's good. Our people are uh, very, very loyal. Oh, nice. Uh, no, yes. Send an official letter of thank you or whatever. Delhi, you're a lady. Yay. Keep building up everything. Come on, what are you missing? Money? I'll, I gave you all the money you need. Why aren't you expanding it? I'll expand it myself, damn it. You know, you know, I promises you need to expand again. Still only third in the world. Holy shit. Germany, how far ahead? You're not far ahead at all. And France, we're catching up as well. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Francy pants. We are number one. Don't you ever forget that. We are number one. Hey! Do, 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 do. Sorry. Uh, we get it again? Seriously? British Union? I mean, we are getting battleships now. We're at 59. The British Union... Why are they invading them? Oh my god, they're about to annex Ireland. Holy shit. Ireland, no! thought you were allied with me. Eh, whatever. So Ireland's falling apart. Do you have any actual navy? Ooh, you do. 214 capital ships. Looks as though you might have some battleships. Yeah, they have level 4, so they have battleships as well. Uh, when? How many more battleships do we need? Just a couple more. Well, with the dismantling on them... Hey, there's Indonesia, and they're civilized, so that's a problem. Eh, whatever. Maybe we'll be able to conquer them. Maybe not. Uh, so the British Union. British Union. If we allied with the United States... Allied with the United States, that would cut them uh, off over here. And these are actual states, too. They're at war with Sardinia and Piedmont. Hmm. Here, let's just increase these relations right now. Now, Japan's going to be a very major ally in this. Very major ally in all of this. And Zidorschland. We're the only ones allied with Germany. Holy shit, Germany, do not bring me into a stupid war, please. Hell, Poland-Lithuania is a better ally than you. I could ally with them, but uh, that would cause problems between me and Germany, so I'm not going to. All right, Army risk management. Let's get bolt-action rifles. Come on, America. We gotta ally. If we ally, we can dismantle them. We could free Canada, maybe, probably. Who knows? I don't know. If we dismantle the British Union, maybe that'll cause Canada to pop out. Maybe. How long do we have this for? Till June of next year. So, America, if you could step your game up and ally with me, that would be swell. Please. Just do it. Do it! I don't think we can do it. I don't think we can do it. Uh, Germany is also at war right now for the Malian, Malian concession. Seriously, what is up with... There's so many people left in Africa. Like, so many little countries. Swazi... Matable, Matable, Cuba actually, I was like, oh right, because Spain owned land. But, um, do Scotland, yes, Scotland, Wales, obviously Ireland's going to pop out now that they're about to annex them. Canada does not, of course, but the Métis Confederation does. Ooh. Okay, so we'll see the Métis Confederation, maybe. Uh, we have Guiana, and of course all their little islands over here. We'll have Jamaica pop out. Belize, or possibly the FRCA will gain land. Probably the FRCA will gain land. And, um, we'll just gain a ton of fucking prestige, and I like that. I like that the most. The most. Of course, we have a truce with them. 
That's negative 200. How long does the truce last? Oh, so it doesn't even matter at all. So we can gain a dismantling on them, but we can't fire it because we have a truce. That is stupid. All right, let's bring our uh, tariffs all the way up. Jesus Christ, we need a lot of tariffs. Who's... Okay, United Provinces, East Bengal and West Bengal are costing us over 3,000. Jesus Christ. United Provinces, where are you? This place... Is this what's costing us the most? Yeah. It's gonna hurt, but let's close down this factory. We can't afford it anymore. What else? We have steel mill in East Bengal, sawmill in West Bengal. S uh, sawmill in West Bengal. And steel mill in East Bengal. There it is. Close them both down. So now we're having a fuck ton more craftsmen unemployed. But that's okay. Because it's alright. It's okay. We don't need them anyways. Uh, alright, just keep decreasing down to 70% tariffs. Yep, we're surviving. Good. Our uh, navy is costing us a ton of money now that we're building battleships. Where's our navy? Where's the rest of our navy? It's, uh... Oh, right, all the way over there. Uh, we'll land them with the rest of the battleships, and then we'll have yeah, 17 or 14 battleships, I believe. We built a lot more battleships, too, now that we built all those level 4 areas. Nah, that's real nice. Of course, uh, we're going to need dreadnoughts eventually. Eventually. Voters' rights rescinded in Timor. Is this Timor? Yeah, no, it's Tidor. There's Timor. Ah, oh, that's Timor. Okay, that little province. Uh, Dutch Indonesia probably gonna fall eventually. Probably. I don't know. They're not giving up for some reason. Oh, that's not even. S Southern Malaya isn't even a colonial area. They have so many Dutch there. And oddly, oddly enough, British. Kind of weird, but whatever. Whatever. Oh my god, Mughal communists! They actually rose up. We actually have a rebellion. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is so cool. Oh my god. Alright, go hunt them all down. Hunt them down and kill them. Who really cares about communists anyways? Not I. Not I. Alright. And you guys hunt them down as well. This is why we had armies spread around our nation. So that we can uh, take down anyone we want to. Aho, aho, aho. Easy peasy, a lemon squeezy. Kill all the filthy commies. And, uh, yeah, get some more cotton. Are we seriously still not? Oh, right, we lost all that, uh, all that industry power, so... We did probably go down a bit. Right. Keep expanding everything you can. Come on. I'll give you all the money you need. All the money you need and it will ever need... Please stop popping up, dear God. Come on. Alright, good. So we can now build cruisers as well. We should probably get some cruisers just so uh, our heavies aren't totally undefended. Because cruisers are good to uh, back up the heavies. So let's build 15 cruisers. Should be a good, good amount. One per each naval base. And it won't even take that long. Yes, we will attend the 4th Olympics. Intervene immediately. God, so many United Pro how, how many are unemployed in the United Provinces? 16% are unemployed. Oh my god, and fucking Germany. What did you do now? Of course, at war with Polish-Lithuania. And of course, Poland-Lithuania is uh, fully mobilized. So, <laughs> Oh, you're an idiot. You are an absolute fucking dunce. You're allied with all of Scandinavia, which is Denmark and Sweden, but, um... You are not smart. Germany, you are not smart. Do you have gas attack? You probably have gas attack. Do they have gas attack as well? They probably do. Fine. We'll join. And Sweden will ally. But Jesus fucking Christ. They have gas attack on you. They have gas defense. You have gas attack. But it's not working. So, I mean, they, they're winning that battle, oddly enough. But whatever. 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 So it's all for fucking Celestia, too. Which is such a waste. Let's keep going down social thought, try and get better education, you know? 
And, uh, okay, so we annihilated that whole army. That's, that's good. Good job, Germany. But, uh, you know, it's not over yet. It's definitely not over yet. Uh, do they have gas attack and gas defense? I don't know if they do. They might, we, actually, we can gain gas defense from this. That'll be good. That'll be real fucking good. Are all these cruisers. Right, they don't count for capital ships. Sad. How incredibly sad. Do they own any more cores on you, Germany? Nope. Alright, and they're ready to surrender. So, there you go. You gain Celestia. Good job. Gold star, little buddy. Gold star. But, um... Wow, how has Ireland not fallen yet? Ireland, you are strong. Very strong for holding them off. And the French... have totally destroyed the poor little Sardinian Piedmont. Poor little guys. Alright, you know what? This is where I'm going to have to end this episode. Yes, so, the Moogle Empire is nice and strong. We had to sadly get rid of some of our industry, but our industry has still exploded nonetheless. Seriously, it's insane how much industry you get from India. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Ilya too, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye. Uh...